I don't like stuff and I really want to have as little of it as possible. And that's why for the past 10 or 15 years, ever since I heard this phrase, I've made it a motto of mine. The best things in life are not things, which shifts our perspective from the materialistic, the latest iPhone, the whatever, into the things that we can't necessarily hold in our hand being the things that matter. Experiences, relationships, etc. This is what matters most in life. And when it comes to what I carry on me, I still wanna have as little as possible, but enough to get the job done. And that's why in this video, I'm gonna show you my simple everyday carry right now. Welcome back to the Financial Freedom System YouTube channel where I make videos that challenge you to upgrade your mindset, money, and more so you can live a life full of financial freedom and purpose. Today, we're going to do things a little bit different. We're mixing it up here, and I'm gonna show you what I carry with me on a daily basis. It's simple, it's minimalistic, but more importantly, it gets the job done. And that's really how I decide if I'm going to take something with me. If it serves a purpose, that's great, it's in there, and if it looks nice, that's a bonus. So I have five main things that I carry with me pretty well all of the time. And five might seem like a lot to you watching this video, especially if you've checked out some other YouTube videos on everyday carries. Uh, but for me, I really do this in a sleek and efficient way. So let's jump into it right now. The first item is something that I talk about with pretty well everyone, whether that's friends or family, maybe my students ask about it, or often when I'm at a store and I pull this out and start using it, I get questions about it. And this is my favorite thing here. This is my Bellroy phone case. Um, it is uh, something that I have used for a couple years now over a couple different iterations with a couple different phone models. Uh, Bellroy is a company that I have used their products for eight years. I've probably had four or five different things from their company and uh, I'm stoked over Bellroy products. I talk about it with everybody. I would recommend it without any hesitation for sure. I love this phone case because um, it holds my cards. It holds what I need. You can see this compartment here. I'm going to pull out one, two, three different cards um, and basically with that, I've got my credit card, my license, and another credit card as well. So you can see kind of the three things here. Um, it has basically what I need, my license when I go driving, and two credit cards in case I get stuck at a place where one company doesn't take American Express, and then I have to use a Visa or a MasterCard or some other type of credit card, or vice versa, right? So, I mean, it kind of covers me at the basics. I can just slide this back in here, and they all tuck away quite nicely. Um, another feature that I really like about this card is if you're a traveler, like I love to travel, um, you can access this little iPhone pin push out thingy that allows you to change your SIM card and check this out. There's also a spot to save another SIM card here. So if you're traveling often between different countries, um, there was a spot where I was living between two countries for quite some time throughout a year. Um, I have my SIM card from that country there. And when I was able to fly down there, I would just pop that out, put the new one back in uh, and vice versa. I'd be able to jump back and forth quite easily. And then I'd have everything I need right here. So there'd be many times rather than take everything with me and have these big bulky pockets hanging out, um, sometimes even if I just had my phone with this case because it carries everything so sleek, um, I'd be set, I'd be good to go. And you can see the phone case here. Uh, one thing that I will say is obviously there are a bunch of different phone cases and styles and sizes. You can check those and their prices out there. Um, there are many different colors. I like the black because it's sleek, it looks good, and it matches kind of everything else in my everyday carry, but you might want a different color. The second item here is a phone and this is something that for many people out there uh, many people are rocking with one obviously just going to clear some notifications and show you i have this phone it's really simple it's the iphone 12 pro now it's not the pro max it's not the iphone 13 it's not the iphone 14 it's not the iphone 30 or whatever it is at the time you're watching this video um, for me this works i don't need the latest device this is a great device that allows me to do everything that I need through my online business. It allows me to talk to people and text people and do everything I need, like I said. And pretty well, with this thing, I could run 
my business. I wouldn't need a fancy computer. I wouldn't need a camera if I didn't have the, the means to go out and buy that. I wouldn't need all this other equipment. You can pretty well do everything that you need with one of these right now. And that's crazy to me because there shouldn't be any excuse for people out there that are looking to start an online business. But for me, um, like I said, I don't need the latest things. I buy a phone and I use it. And when it's done, when it's broken, when it's replaceable, I get a new one, but I'm not focused on getting the latest one every single time something changes or a new one comes out. Because in the end, if I'm focusing on those things, it's really taking away from the things that matter to me in my life. So that's why I don't go ahead and buy the latest one every single time. You're gonna see my phone case here. You're gonna see my phone. It's very simple. It pops in there nice and quick and uh, you're good to go. So again, with this kind of combination right here, I've got my phone, I've got my computer, it runs my business, I do all these things with it, but I also have a SIM card. I also have that iPhone push out thing that nobody can ever find when they need it. Um, and then I've got three card space in here. I mean, it's super versatile, especially when you throw your license in there, when you put some credit cards or you put your bank card, everything you need can literally be right here, which is why I love this so much, and which is why, until I see a better solution, Bellroy, this phone case is what I'm going to be using, and I don't get paid to tell you that. So that is the second item. And the third item on my list is this watch. Now, you're gonna see it is a brown leather strap, it is a blue face, and basically with this watch, um, it does what I need it to do. And I kind of feel naked without it, so I'm gonna put it on right now, because I pretty well wear this every single day. Whether I am more dressed up in a, a casual outfit or whether I'm wearing something that is much more fancy, um, it kind of meets both worlds and that's why I like it. And for those of you that are passionate about watches, obviously that is incredible, that's amazing. Um, I really enjoy talking to people that are passionate about anything, whether it's watches or whether it's a sport, whether it's something else, it doesn't matter, right? But for me, I know that that's not where I'm at right now in my life. I can appreciate a nice looking watch. I can appreciate a luxurious watch like a Tissot or a, a Rolex or something like that. But for me, I only have one watch because I can only wear one watch. And the fourth item on my list are my keys. These are something that I have with me pretty well all of the time, but you can see I try to keep them pretty simple, pretty slick, pretty streamlined. I don't want to be the person that has like 30 keys on this big key chain that I have to wear around my neck. Uh, for me, that's big and bulky. Um, this basically, I can fold it up and just slip it into my pocket and it doesn't even look like I've got anything. So I've got my basic house keys, I've got my car keys, and I got what I need to get into work. And then from there, I'm set up. I think less is more when it comes to keys. And the fifth item that I carry with me at least most days, or at least when I need it, is my wallet here. And it is a genuine leather Buxton wallet. Um, it's black, it's very, you can see basically here, it's as thin as it possibly can be. I carry with me very little cash because of the videos you've seen on my channel. I really try to take it advantage of the rewards points. So I'm using my credit card about 95% of the time, but I've got $20 cash in case I find myself in a spot where my credit cards aren't working or maybe I need to um, give that to somebody as a gift or for whatever reason, it's there in a, really in an emergency setting. Um, I've got my business credit card. I'm not carrying that with me uh, at all times. And I have some basic like health cards and like a prepaid visa card that somebody gave me as a gift. But you can see there's not a lot of stuff in here and I really can't keep it as simple as possible. I can remember growing up and, and seeing people that I know with wallets that look like three inches thick like it just I, I didn't even know how or why they carried that much stuff around in their wallet and so I kind of made that promise to myself that I wouldn't be that person so um, that is something that I just carry with me at least when I need it most of the time um, I push my wallet aside I leave it at home and I can carry everything that I need here in my phone case slash wallet um, I've got my watch and then I also have my keys. So there's really kind of four items that are with me every single day, all the time. And then that wallet would be the fifth thing that I add it if I'm going out or if I need it 
for a specific reason. So that's my minimalistic everyday carry right now. I wanna know what you thought of these items. Are there anything that you thought was interesting? Anything that you thought was really practical? Anything that you wish you had maybe for your everyday carry or something that you would do absolutely without? Go ahead and let me know down in the comments below. And if you like this video, hit the thumbs up button and please subscribe to the Financial Freedom System YouTube channel to help you learn how to live a life of financial freedom.